Shifting focus over to the United States, U.S. President Donald Trump said that the United States is prepared to send as many as 15,000 troops to the U.S.-Mexico border. Trump said that the U.S. troops will counter the approaching caravan of migrants. Terry is out. We have about 5,008. We'll go up to anywhere between 10 and 15,000 military personnel on top of Border Patrol, ICE, and everybody else at the border. Nobody's coming in. We're not allowing people to come in. Trump's latest hardline came just two days after he announced the deployment of 5,200 troops to the border. The caravan has at least 3,500 people. All of these people left Honduras in mid-October. They have advanced 250 miles into Mexico. The caravan is nearly 1,000 miles away from the U.S. border. It could take weeks for these Central American migrants to reach the U.S. Trump, however, claimed that the caravan would reach the border faster than most of us think. Currently, there are at least 2,100 U.S. troops at the border. An additional 5,200 troops are being deployed. The Pentagon on Wednesday said that more than 7,000 troops have been withdrawn from 10 states. These troops would support the U.S. Department of Homeland Security along the border. Now, with the deployment of 15,000 more troops, the size of the forces in the U.S.-Mexico border would be roughly equivalent to the U.S. military presence in Afghanistan. This will also be three times the size of the U.S. troops in Iraq. Yes.